we want to go to the World Cup. We haven't been there since 98. I can't even start to imagine how would it feel for the nation, for the players. And for me as a captain to be going to the World Cup. What a moment that would be. What a moment. When we qualified in 1998, it was the biggest thing to happen in Jamaica since independence. They declared a national holiday. Results have to improve if we're going to qualify this time. One game, one defeat, and the reggae boys are bottom of the group. 98, World Cup 98, I was eight. You were eight? Then you had seven then? Yeah, six. You how much? Me and nine, to year. 92? 94. Yeah, 94? 98 and a 4. Ah, oh, he's a baby. <laughs> yeah, because you're well young, so you probably not remember that. You're, you're like DeAndre age. Because I'm 8 and I can't remember much. Jamaica, you, you would saw one, one of the best uh, World Cup songs. Ooh. 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 song that is tough for you, you know? Rise up. <laughs> I. And then take your place. Yes, yes. Winning, bringing healing to a nation because you know what it does? It brings the people together. It unifies them, even if it's for one moment. It's like when they win, we all win. When they lose, we all lose. We have a great group, but I don't think the group understands yet what it's going to take to get to a World Cup. But something that I have detected as a leader, I have to fix. If we feel like because we have talent, we won't have to work we're gonna have a problem. We have pride for our country. We have pride for our athletes who go out there and actually do their best. And we know most of them don't come back to no big accolades. It's one of the most talented groups we've ever had. But if you don't fit the system or you're not in with what we're about, then I don't think we need you. I would describe this current team as, um, a mixture of English and Jamaican born players. We have 23 guys coming in, 23 different backgrounds, and 23 different egos. It's hard. I want to win. And, you know, if I sense that the unity is not there, you know, I, I tend to get really worried. That's it. Let us pray. As we carry the hopes and dreams of our people, let us understand that our service is first and foremost to our people. You're not going to be able to beat a good team if you're not together. Where we are weak, let us be strong. That we will overcome the many rivers we have to cross. Greetings, football family. Happy World Cup qualifiers. We have got big problems with the Jamaica national team right now. I mean, we've gambled on some new players who have only just qualified to play for Jamaica. Just throwing players together doesn't really work. You have to feel for Andrea Blake, captain of the side who are barely trained together. You guys ready to sing later? Uh, how about this song? <laughs> when new players come in, they have to sing a song. That's kind of a way to come together collectively and to just have some fun. Tonight, big stage show. Music is so important to sports, you know. It's like it kind of it kind of goes hand in hand. Roof is ready. Roof is not ready, fam. Roof is opening the show. <laughs> For me, unity is one of the most important things. 
Sometimes you can tell when that's not there. Hey, no, it doesn't need to be good, bro. <laughs> they heard about you, eh? They heard about you and a big performance tonight. challenge right now going into the World Cup qualifiers is to get this group to play as a team. Jamaica trying to build from their half. Jamaica giving away possession. Panama on the attack puts the play on the left hand side. Right down to Rodriguez. A shot and right to goal. Keep a big diamond to his right. couldn't put five passes together. It was just chaotic. Panama on the attack, what a strike! There was no cohesiveness, there was no chemistry. Forward again, here comes Panama, floating more inside the plateau, head off, beautiful header! After the second goal, oh my word! Am I dreaming? Is this happening for real? Will somebody wake me up. The visitors, they're leading by two goals to nil. Coach Tapa Whitmore of the Jamaica team has to make some changes because Panama, they're all over the Jamaicans at the present time. Not constructive. Not constructive. Bro, to me, I think we should start by pressing them. We're at home. We're down 2 nil. We need to chase the game. We need a structure of pressing. If we go, we get a We need a structure. We need to fucking change formation. We're too open in midfield. We need someone sat in the middle. Well, stop talking, Bruce. Before you talk about formation, before you talk about anything, right? They're out fighting us. They're quicker to the ball. They're quicker to the second balls, guys. Right? We're pressing and just dragging up to the ball. It's like a testimonial. What is that all about? They're moving quicker than us. We're at home. We are at home. You can do any formation you want. They run faster, quicker than you. Guess what? We get beat. Come on, come on. They need to think this is a cold in here and it's too hot. Somebody take some leadership. Somebody just take the game by the scruff of the neck and go. At 2 0, I was still in the game, at least to get a point. I do feel um, somewhat distant as the goalkeeper, and it can be very frustrating, you know, especially whenever I get scored on. Waterman dances. And needs to go keep up there to his left. Oh, my word. That's Cherry on the top, icing on the kick. That was like the dagger, and that's it. And that signals the end of the matchup. Captain Blake looks dejected. It could have easily been 6-0. We didn't fight hard enough. We didn't show enough character. 